The best hidden secrets of Michelangelo's Last Judgment in the Sistine Chapel, one of the most spectacular works of art in the world, will come to light in a few months. The Vatican Museum has joined forces with Marco Balish, producer of the inauguration ceremonies of the 2006 Winter Paralympics in Torino, 2014 Winter Olympics in Sochi, and Expo 2015 in Milan, to create a show that combines theater and special effects. He promises a lifelike immersion in this fascinating work that reminds us that all of humanity will be judged for its actions. When people come into this one hour long show, they will think they're going to see a three dimensional documentary on the Sistine Chapel and Michelangelo, but then they will discover a show that moves them because of its power and amazing visuals. In the end, the show will give you a very deep spiritual experience. And there is a technical problem. There is no talking allowed in the Sistine Chapel because it's a sacred place. Not even guides are allowed to explain the paintings. A person feels amazed as soon as they enter the Sistine Chapel. The aim of this synergy between the oldest art and the most modern technology is to allow younger generations to learn about the greatest gems of art in the way in which they are most accustomed, the digital screen. We are convinced that this type of media is fundamental for new generations, but also that the use of these new technologies reaches a public that wouldn't be exposed to the most traditional paintings without them. The musician Sting also participates in this show, singing different songs. The show will allow the public to understand the origin of The Last Judgment and find out about Michelangelo's best kept secrets. In this way, the Vatican Museum shows that despite watching over some of the oldest works in existence, they also know how to adapt to modern times.